Today's lesson will be on division with fractions and decimals, and it will cover CPM Chapter 7, Part 2, Lesson 3. So the vocabulary word today is the multi multi multiplicative inverse, which is two numbers whose product is one, also known as the reciprocal. So for example is, we have nine divided by one ninth, which equals nine over nine, which is equal to one. So right here we have um, a division problem, which is two-fifths divided by three-fourths. So we're going to use a supergiant one on this problem. So first things first, we need to do two-fifths over three-fourths. And then we want our denominator for the answer to, e to be one. So that means that... Um, we need to do four thirds, four thirds times three fourths, since that would equal one. And then on top of that, we're gonna put four thirds again because it's a giant one. So the numerator and the denominator need to be the same. And then that would be two times four equals eight, and five times three equals fifteen over one, or twelve twelfths which would be equal to 8 fifteenths. And you can simplify that to 8 fifteenths, which is then your solution. Try this one on your own using the supergiant one. 3 sevenths divided by 4 fifths. Okay, when you solve this, we set it up as a fraction multiplied it by our supergiant one using the reciprocal of the denominator, which is 5 fourths. Use that to, for your numerator, multiplied straight across. Um, when we had 20 over 20, I simplified that down to 1, so we can actually get rid of that 20 over 20. And 15 over 28 uh, is your simplified solution. Try one more on your own. 9 fifths divided by 2 thirds. Again, use the supergiant one. Okay, once again, did the same way, 9 fifths um, divided by 2 thirds, written as a fraction, multiplied by your supergiant 1 using the reciprocal of the denominator. Uh, 9 times 3 is 27, 5 times 2 is 10, uh, 2 times 3 and 3 times 2 are both 6, crossed out because it's 1. And then I move my numerator down here, and I have 27 over 10, which simplifies to 2 and 7 tenths. 